This is the new IK Foam Pro 12 with the battery compressor. Is it any good? Let's find out. So I just received this and after opening everything up, this is not necessarily a brand new foamer. It's the same thing as the other IK foamer that I have. The difference is we now have a separate component, this battery compressor to fill your tank continuously. So let's find out how it builds up to pressure and then actually use it on a job and see how it performs. So we won't have to pump it. We won't have to use our separate air compressor, which we have on our line over there, which again is not difficult to pump up, but this does everything automatically. Let's get to using it. I filled this up with about a gallon and a half of water and we're gonna use some active foam and this is going to be our pre-wash. So just about an ounce to a gallon and a half is usually what I do and it will foam up plenty. Now this pre-wash, this is Koch Chemie's active foam. This is actually intended more for ceramic coatings because it's not such a high pH that it's going to cause any issues. And for ceramic coatings, of course, it can resist high pH. That's not really the problem. But even for other cars that are protected with waxes and sealants, this kind of does it all. So let's turn this thing on for the first time. Let's see what happens. Oh, and just a tip, the rubber gasket on this seal here, um, I usually put a little bit of Vaseline on that and it kind of helps keep the seal. Also with this, we do have the safety valve. So this will actually pop up when it pumps up to pressure. So let's see if it actually does that. Now we put the battery to charge. So let's put it in here. She should be all charged up. And actually the battery itself has a little indicator. Yep, looking good. There's a little on switch right here. Oh, look at that, I made a mess. Let's make sure everything is tightened down. I thought I did that, but apparently not. Much better. So I noticed that it just stopped as this was just starting to pop up. So perfect, it stops automatically. All right, so far so good. User error on my part because it was uh, not tightened all the way. And again, all of those rubber gaskets and seals, you can put Vaseline on them or whatever your lubricant of choice. Oh boy, I gotta clean all this up. I got it everywhere. Oh, I got it in my boots. Oh, that's okay. Oh, and that active foam smells nice. So here's my other IK Foamer Pro 12, and I love this thing. I've been using Super Clean in here. I've, I've used other all-purpose cleaners and uh, the Active Shampoo and the Super Foam in this as well. Now the cool thing is it's the same exact thing. I can actually swap out that battery pack and put it on here, which I might actually do that because this is Super Clean, and we have a full detail coming in today that's never been that hasn't been detailed by us today and I wanna start with something stronger. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm gonna swap the battery pack and put it on my older IK Foamer. Now you may also notice that even the older IK Foamer here has that little knob and it lines up with the battery pack. So it stays put and it'll click into place. There you go. Now at this point, I'm not 100% sure if they're gonna be selling these battery packs separately. I'm not sure as of yet. I think that would be a wise decision, but we'll see. Because those with older IK foamers can still buy the battery pack and put it onto their older ones. Perfect. All right, that worked really well. Let's see. All right, so that was an easy swap. And I have to say, these IK foamers are incredible. I use these bigger ones 
more than I use the other spray bottles, like the little small IK foamers, like this little guy here. I haven't used this one in so long. These guys are just awesome. And now that I have two, I can put one for super clean for really, really deep cleaning, and then one for my active foam or super foam when I wanna use that for protected vehicles. I would use active foam for protected vehicles. Uh, super foam is really strong, so I usually just use that in the foam cannon. But again, still a great option. So you put whatever you want in your IK Pro 12s. Let me know down below, what do you put in here? Do you put rinses washes? Do you put other APCs? Do you put iron removers? What do you put in your IK Foam Pro 12s like this? And if you wanna grab, one of these with the battery pack, I'll have links down below. Once again, I don't know if they're gonna be selling the battery pack separately. I assume it would be a wise decision to do so, but I don't know at this point. You can still save 10% if you enter code Miranda10 at Car Supplies Warehouse. How cool is that? Turns on automatically, love it. So I am loving this. I already love this IK foamer. Having the battery pack on it is such an awesome accessory. It just fills up automatically. You don't even have to worry about doing anything, no pumping, no using your air compressor. Everything is just right here and it just fills up automatically. So it's a no brainer. This is gonna speed things up. It is awesome. So I'm very, very happy with this. Again, guys, if you wanna try it for yourself, if you already use your air compressor and you don't need this, totally fine. But say you're mobile and you don't want to have to have a huge air compressor or something like that, this is going to save you. So super fast, very efficient. It's just a great accessory to have for your IK foamer.